Good evening, everyone. It's your boy, Kenny G. And I'm just here chilling at my home, um, home office, grinding. Um, had a very busy work day. Um, thankful for my partners, Brian and Sharina King, who have joined me in this Avon adventure. I am so excited for you guys. I have an appointment um, with someone else joining Avon. Though, um, she seems iffy, and, um, I, I hope that she does join. I'm already building an Avon team, um, trying to make it to unit leader, um, uh, before my birthday, if I can. I don't know, we, we have some monkey wrenches in the way. Um, I, I, I'm not doing a positivity class today, and it's just because I'm exhausted. And when I actually do these positivity classes, like, I research. I, I do find, you know, things and ideas of how to think more positive. And to be honest, um, today I've been going through some very um, different things. Um, but I just want to talk about how I'm able to stay positive during these things. And I think they're relevant for the class. Um, on, I want to say it was Tuesday evening. I lost all feeling to my left foot. I'm talking about can't move toes, can't feel it, couldn't do anything. Lost all feeling in my left toe. I mean, my left, my left foot, not my toe, but the whole foot. And um, then on Wednesday, yesterday, no, um, maybe it happened Wednesday, I think, and then Thursday, yesterday, I saw the doctor, and you know, the doctor had some MRI results that I took in last week, and the MRI told the whole story, um, basically the MRI said that, um, I have nerves sticking out of my spine, and, um, that I would need surgery, I would need spinal surgery, um, then, um, you know, it's kind of scary, you know, losing feeling in a foot plus the idea of surgery coming. But, you know, I, I'm able to stay positive just because I, I have hope. Um, I think part of, I think negativity is a choice. I think we can choose to negatively, you know, go, you know, crazy out just like, ah! this and that and I'm so upset at the situation and I can go crazy and we can do that sure I know a lot of people who do do that I am one of them on a, on a often I used to at least used to um I'm, I'm, I'm actually you know the year 2013 is the year of positivity and that's why I'm starting this year with the positivity class as far as videos I'm going from the blog. And that's just because I think it's important to stay positive. I think that it's all very, 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 very important. Um, the, um, the green news conglomerate, as I call my blogging empire, just in my head, it's not that official, but, um, we, we have some food things that are coming on the convincible.us blog. Um, check that out. And uh, lots more um, stories from business for Empower Network blog. So, um, we're going to, you know, keep on pushing, keep on keeping on, keep it easy breezy, you know. Um, but, how can I stay positive during a time of physical ailment? And I, I think that is simple faith. So we, we are going to turn this positivity class. Have, have a faith. Believe in something. If you're atheist, that's cool. But believe in the power of yourself if you're atheist. Believe in the power of your mind or whatever. If that's believing in spells if you're Wiccan or prayer if you're Christian. You know, believe in God, believe in yourself, believe in something, believe in something, 
to help you get through the previous 12 times. This has been Positivity Class, which boy can't agree.